What is up guys, Zach Scott here, playing, you guessed it, Bellatro again. We have unlocked the black deck, which gives you an extra joker slot at the cost of you lose a hand per round. Uh, or every round you have one fewer hand. So, you know, you can get a joker to deal with that, but then it kind of cancels out. But, you know, the thing is, with one fewer hand, uh, you're more likely to lose. What is this? Rerolls shop, rerolls in the next, no, let's just play this one. So let's see if we can win with only three hands. I guess we have, so we're starting with three hands this time. Three, four, five, six, where's my, geez, I hate when it's like a near, it's so close. It's so close to a lot of things. Let's ditch this and go for a flush. They don't want us to win. <laughs> they don't want us to win. Let's just play this and see what happens. It's gonna be terrible. 56 is not that great. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, there you go. That's pretty good. That'll get us a good score. Might maybe even a win right here. And so we'll take it. <laughs> I don't know how long I'm going to be playing this game, but right now I'm kind of hooked to it and I haven't yet beaten the game. So I feel like I at least need to beat the game before the series ends. The stencil one is really good, uh, but we're using a deck that wants us to have more jokers. So, ugh. This one is $8. Each uh, played card with diamond suit gives a multiplayer uh, times 1.5. Oh, oh, but the suit changes. That's interesting. Let's just try that out. Why not? Next round. Uh, it gives me a free pack, but I feel like I'm not ready for that. So it's going to be diamond this time. Each play card with diamond gives them, okay, so two, three, five, five, six, seven, five, six, seven, eight. Gosh, dang it. I hate the nears. Like, just get out of here with that. Oh, wait, we have a flush opportunity. Never mind. There's a flush. No diamonds in the play, but maybe we'll get some diamonds soon. 260 ain't bad. Five five five. But there you go. Triple right there. Let's also ditch these cards. That's good, and that's a win. But we, have, we only have three hands. Keep that in mind. So it's a little dicey. This black deck, rather. So let's just see what we got here. Cash out, sure. Now it's gonna be hearts. Uh, oh, a four malt for each card below 52. Ah, uh, we can't afford both. We, I can't even afford that. I can, I can turn something into a glass card, though, which will help thin the deck a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and buy that and just kind of move forward with it. Next round. We probably need to not... All clubs are debuffed. We probably need to, you know, focus that on, like, the two of spades, for example. We could definitely... Use that on the two of spades. It'll now be a glass card, and hopefully it'll eventually get uh, one in four chance to destroy. I guess that's when it's played, though. Um, uh, okay. We got a three of a kind at 150. Five, six. Let's see what two pair gets us with the aces. Oh, I forgot about the multiplier. Hearts. Hearts is where it's at this round. That was terrible. Last round, uh, this just sucks. Seven, eight, nine, ten, yeah. It's not a win, unfortunately, sorry. I don't, I'm not so sure I'm gonna appreciate the uh, the black deck at this, uh, with, with my level of inexperience. I don't think I'm gonna appreciate the black deck. So let's just go back to the main menu. Um, I haven't even fully figured out how to, how to you know, so anyway. We could do the green deck again, which gives us, you know, a ton of money, but no interest. It really incentivizes us to spend early, spend often. 
I like the green deck quite a lot. Having an extra hand with a blue deck could be useful. Um, let's just do the green deck again. I had a lot of fun with it last episode. I think the key is gonna be though, rerolls all clubs are debuffed, okay. What do we got here? So close. Let's go ahead and just go with the triple twos. And then also ditch these weak cards as well. Three of a kind. Yeah, you know. 100 is fine for this early on. I probably want to do that later. 10 jack. Uh, there's a nice little straight right there. And this will probably win the round for us, I imagine. There you go. It's on fire. So... We're gonna hit up a store and we're gonna get extra, all this extra currency for the two hands remaining, three discards, 10 bucks this early on, it's actually 14. Allow straight to be made with gaps of one rank. Weird. That is so weird. It converts up to three selected cards to diamonds. That could be good too, but we just gotta remember we're going for a diamonds run. Sure, I haven't used that joker. Just keep in mind three, five, so with one, so I mean, I gotta really pay attention to that then. Let's look at this one. What other joker do we want here? Prevents death if chips scored or at least 25% of required chips self-destruct. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool too though. A one in two chance to create a tarot card when any booster pack is opened. I kind of like that. Next round. Oh, I have zero money so doubling my money doesn't work. So it converts things into diamonds. So if we're gonna start going for flushes and things like that, then that could be really good. I'm gonna play this out now and get this out of here. And then uh, six, six, uh, yeah, another two pairs here is good. This is how many? Three cards to diamonds? Sure. Let's go for that flush. I mean, it's a one in four, no, one in two chance. This'll work. Oh, maybe for a win, I don't know. Maybe not, maybe not for the win, win. That did win, okay, great. Yeah, so far I think the green deck is my favorite. But I don't know if I have to use the black deck to unlock more decks, I don't know. This joker contains plus two, if, if a played hand contains two pair. Ooh, that's really cool. It could just grow and grow. I like both, I like this one. And I like the Wheel of Fortune. Buy and use. Nope, dang. So two pairs. Clubs are debuffed. Let's aim for two pairs and we'll just keep buffing it up. Uh, we have a flush, thanks to the diamonds that I have. No pairs at all, so, you know, it works. Uh, nine, nine, yeah, let's ditch these clubs really quick. Dang, but we have. Look at that, a flush. 
That's great. And with the ace and the queen scoring high and the 10 scoring high, that's probably going to be a great score. Almost push us over the edge. If I could get, yeah, I, I could get two pair out of this and buff up. We can buff up that Joker, the spare trousers. For the upgrade of the two malt. I mean, this is going to be one of the ones that just keeps growing on us. I like the ideas of Jokers just growing and growing and growing. And hope I can pull that off. So nine. Uh, this. Five dollars for each card at six. Converting to spades is another option. We wouldn't want to change diamonds to spades though. Let's look at using these uh, these packs. Oh, we got the tarot. We, that, that worked. Enhances two cards to lucky cards. The bonus cards. Let's use the Wheel of Fortune. Nope. Dang. I tried so hard. All right, let's uh, world to spades. Let's just go next round. Enhancing to lucky cards. Shop as a free uncommon joker. Sure. Uh, this one is... Uh, I have to, I have to, let's just play. All right, uh, two, three. So this is a situation where it would be really beneficial if we could just get another pair here somewhere. And then play this, and then our trousers will get an upgrade. So now it's a plus four multiplier. Automatically, like just every round, plus four. And that's wonderful. Uh, so close, seven, seven. Dang, two, three, four. But we have this. So another two pairs. So our pants get upgraded again. Now, I guess one thing I worry about is that the multiplier is good, but is it good enough to, to win us the game? Dang, three, four, five, six, seven. That's pretty good, but, but we also still get the pants multiplier, right? Yes. I love it. Enhances two selected cards, two lucky cards. So that was a little bit tougher of a round somehow. We're gonna have like a freebie joker in the shop. So catch up with seven, we have 10 now total. This joker gains three chip per discarded club card. It's free. And this is Buy and use that. The pairs grow. Just the regular pairs, though. I, I keep forgetting about the shortcut. I might honestly just sell that card if I need, because it's such a. I just keep forgetting about it. Let's see. Uh. Man, we'll probably not use. I use the Earth card. Minus one hand size. Let's go. Four, five, six. So yeah, I got some chips got upgraded. Dang. Ah, three of a kind, huh? We're aiming for sixteen hundred. That's not bad. Great.
that's a good score too. And we got another upgrade on the pants. So the two pairs, really aiming for those two pairs, you know. Two kings. Uh. This is not gonna be a good score. But the malt is, you know, okay, fine. Okay, yeah, I want it for us. Okay, I'll take it. Great. Great stuff. Great stuff, for sure. Whew. These pants are so cool. Spare trousers. This is kind of cool, but I I've used that before. Each face card held in hand has a one in two chance to give a dollar. Probably gain plus one discard each round. I don't have enough to afford that. Boosting the Celestial Pack, though, could be interesting. Or we could just wait. Let's just wait. Uh, gives a free pack. I don't want that pack. Let's play it out. 888, 9, 10. It's fine. It's not, you know, it doesn't increase our spare trousers. Like you would hope. This will increase the spare trousers, though. This is basically just me going for the two pairs as often as I can. Uh, seven, eight, nine, ten. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nine, uh, let's just do this. I also need to remember I need to start discarding clubs just like kind of randomly almost in order to get uh, more chips. Because the six chips is good, but really, we you know, we're going to want even more than that. Right. Eight dollars. This Joker, four dollars at the end of every round. Come on, let's do it. Buy and use. Give us something good. No, come on, really. All right, the voucher. The, permanently getting the discard would be really good because then I can discard more clubs, which gives us more chips. I don't really want. Let's go. Skip it to get uh, a foil joker, which is plus 50 chips, which is kind of cool, but I just don't know how ready I am for it. Let's just play. Oh, shoot. What was the, I, oh man, I didn't even read what the thing was. Three, five, six, seven. Let's just discard all of this. All right, the threes and the eights are good. Twelve malts, just that's a really good thing, I guess. <laughs> Jacks, ten Jack. Okay, we got a straight here. You love to see it. I love to see it. I keep forgetting we could do the the the. I, I think I'm honestly going to sell this Joker, the shortcut. I'm just not. I'm not in the right mindset to play that type of card. Uh, nine 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 nine. Yeah, seven, eight, nine, ten, jack, another straight. There you go. I honestly think I'm gonna sell that Joker card. Good score. I really don't know what the next, what the boss has in store for us. I'm a little worried because I didn't pay attention. Cash out for nine. Of a pair. Yeah, that could be worth it. Let's do an Arcana pack. Yeah, we got the world. Converts three to spades. So, what are we working on right now? Are we working on spades? 
No, we didn't do anything like that. Okay. <laughs> we didn't convert any of them yet. Okay, my bad. Uh, convert them to diamonds. Yes. Give me a holographic joker, please. Yes! What does this do? Wait, wait, what does it do? Oh, 50 chips. Great. Uh, yeah, a pair. Oh, well, see, I would do that, but. Yeah, buy that. That's fine. Celestial pack as well. We're just spending all of our money because I don't. I literally don't know what we're up against. Great flush, two pair. Yeah, we're working on the two pairs. If we're gonna be playing two pairs a lot, let's do it. Uh, next round. We're out of money. A decreased level of played poker hand. Okay. Not sure I care too much about that. Ten, ten, king, king. There you go. Worth it. Play hand. Oh God. Okay. Okay. Okay, great. <laughs> I was I was starting to worry there what was happening. There you go. Another upgrade for the pants. And the 50 chips is really good. I mean, that doubles our score basically in a lot of these plays. Wow. Awesome. Love it. So this is uh, spades. I need to use these probably. All right, uh, this joker. I mean, yeah, so I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna sell this thing for $3. Wow, really, it's an uncommon. I think I'm just gonna buy this. Uh, it seems good enough. A permanent plus one hand size? Are you joking, kidding me? That's awesome. Let's open up this mega arcana. Oh, dang, I'm out of money. Next round. Uh, next space edition shop, Joker is free and becomes polychrome. That sounds good. Oh wait, but oh, I already have a full thing of Jokers. Dang it, what was I thinking? Let's just play this one. One in seven cards get drawn face down. Should be okay. Two pair, you better believe it. I love upgrading those pants. Love it. Good score all around. There you go. Oh, I should have discarded those, uh, those clubs. Wow. But you get the, the banner really kind of offsets that too. All right, cash out. What do we got here? Uh, buffoon, whoa. Oh, resets when campfire. This joker gains a multiplier for each card sold. Resets when boss blind is defeated. What is this one? No. Man, it's, it's interesting, right? I don't know about that. I mean, maybe. The thing is, is it resets. But it's a polychrome. I'm, not, I'm just not gonna be selling a lot, am I? Do our cannon pack. Um, I 
Sure. You know what? Yeah, we'll do that. And then I'll convert both of these to lucky cards. And then if we want any of these to become a glass card. Let's double my money. Uh, you know, you know what? I am gonna sell this. I'm gonna take this card. And then maybe I'll just sell a bunch of cards. Maybe that's what I'll do. I'll buy cards and sell them. Let's do it. Uh, so I see a beautiful combo here. This multi is uh, it's already gonna be a 1.5 by default. Look at that, that's great. So here, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and discard those, upgrade that a little bit. There we go. This should be a good, good win there. I mean. The 24 malt. I'm just trying to think about how we're going to sell cards. It's only a 0.25, but I mean, it could, it could work. Uh, this is converts to hearts. Yeah, yeah, I do want that. Another hand, love it. I mean, th this is a, kind of an all around play. Uh, Yeah, let's let's do these celestial packs then. Let's see what we got. Um, yep, yeah, level that up. Great. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. Open this up. I mean, I guess I could upgrade this, the straight flush. Might as well. I think we're good. Let's go to the next round. I don't think I need the sun. I don't want to create jokers, so we're just gonna play this. Two, three, four, five, six. It's not a bad one. I don't know that it's a great one, but it's not bad. The 24 malt is really good. I'm, I'm just growing it as much as I can. The two pair is absolutely wonderful. I could have done the other aces as malt cards. I didn't think about that. I'm so dumb. That's a great, that's a great one. There you go. Uh, jump, I don't really want any extra playing cards. Next round, let's go, let's go. I should have re-rolled. Adds one voucher, yeah, let's do that. Let's play five cards, no problem. No problem, I'll play the five cards. Uh, No pairs, unfortunately, so I'm going to disc, wait, two, three, five, six, yeah. Uh, 
let's just get rid of these cards. Discard those. There you go. There's your pairs for you. Let's play five. Not a problem. The Psychic. Why, why is it called the Psychic? Like, do, do these names even matter? Love it. Love it, love it, love it. It's so good. Play again. Oh, I should have, well, whatever. Next time I find aces, I'll try to figure that out. This is, this is gonna be really good. Another great score. I mean, I don't know what to say. I'm gonna have a voucher in the next shop, though. Not, it won't be free, but it'll be there. And we can see what I can get. There you go. Uh, planet, uh, no. I mean, sure, a discounted, sure. What? Why not, why not, right? Clearance, yeah, we've done that before. Uh, enhances two to bonus cards. Converting to hearts. What are we, we're working on spades though, right? Or did we convert them? Oh wait, what? Oh no, we have more, yeah, no, we're not doing hearts. We're doing, uh... wait, we're doing diamonds. We're doing diamonds and spades. I didn't realize that. So I don't really want to convert to hearts unless we're converting. No, I don't want to do that at all. Let's do our cannon pack, open that up. And we can uh, convert something into, let's do the Wheel of Fortune. We want to do that. The glass card could be cool. Because we could technically possibly destroy a card, which would help us. So we're work yeah, so let's. But I kind of want to see if I, no, dang it. I was rolling on the Joker. That's okay. Next round. The hook discards two random cards per hand played. Let's go, dude. What do we got here? Play it. All right. We have a four of a kind opportunity here, which is great. Look at this, this is the, the time seven. So the multiplier is just gonna keep going up. So it's at a 32 right now. I haven't sold any cards. So this, you know, may not even do anything. There you go, look at this, I love this. This is gonna be a good score. Big malt, big malt, big score. Okay, so we're gonna have to, we're gonna, we're gonna get some cool stuff, but this next, the, being just like random cards, I'm a little worried that like there'll be cards I really need. Uh, plus two hand size, minus one hand each round. Not really what I want. Uh, level up, my card, no. Let's do the jumbo arcana pack. And then, uh, again, it's one of those things where it's like, let's do uh, malt. Let's malt these two. And then let's uh, take a look at uh, Joker. Come on. No, still no. Killing me. Celestial pack. Whatever. If I play anything cool, it'll work out.
Uh, next round. Discarding for every for hand played. Um, let's see what card gets discarded. Oh shoot! Oh wait, it's a discard, not a destroy. It's just a, just a discard, not a destroy. Okay, good, 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 good. I got freaked out for a second there. That's not a big deal. It's a discard. I, for whatever reason in my head, I was thinking discard. This might be one of the easier bosses then. Three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, the castle, the suit changes all the time. Anyway, that's a win for us. Let's just move on. Huh. That's really interesting. Uh, Wily Joker. Not discovered, plus two, malt, play and then straight. Reroll boss by one time per ante, ten dollars per roll. I like that idea of being able to reroll the boss. Jumbo celestial pack. Hey, we got this death card. I kind of like the idea of converting like a two to an ace or something like that. two pair out of there. The two pair is like, just like everything I need. Uh, skip it for a three hand size next round. Extra large blind. Oh, I just have to score a ton of points. All right, let's just play these then. I don't want to get carried away. Uh, nine, ten, Jack. No. Discarded heart. Uh, what do I want to play? Maybe that. I'm going to be trying to upgrade my Joker in the castle then. I need, I need to discard hearts if possible. The 40 malt is good, obviously. Uh... Oh, this might just win it for us. Um, then I won't get to... Whatever, here we go. Currently 42, I played two pairs, did it not get upgraded? We won that one, okay, moving on. Oof. I can sell this though. I'm gonna go and upgrade them. They're cheap. Might as well do it, right? This is probably the longest run we've had. Nice. Uh, two random planet cards. I'm gonna sell this one, which will upgrade to that, which is good. Uh, sure, use that one. Um, let's just play it. This is a big score that we need.
And we need to discard clubs. That'll upgrade the pants again, so now it's at a 44 malt. Nice. Wow, good score. Alright, so I, I just want to discard all these. Just to upgrade that a little bit. And I want to get the two pair just to, you know... Again, the two pair is crucial for the, the pants upgrades. So the 40, why is it still a 46? Uh, was it 40? I don't know. It's a 46 malt. We won that one. So I, we should be able to handle this next one, I think. So. All right. Sold it for the upgrade. Every played card permanently gains. That's interesting. We could ditch the hallucination and try to get every played card permanently gains plus five when scored. Oh, we're so late in the round though. I don't know. Let's open this up. Two pair. Use it really quick. Next round. Just gotta score a lot of points, dude. I hope we can do it, but we'll see. So the good news is that we have something like this. This carded spades could work. Let's play this. This is gonna be a really great score, hopefully. It upgrades the pants. We have 50, sure. Good score. Uh, now we have the tens and the eights. I think we can pull through with this, we'll see. Is that a 50 malt? Wow, that campfire is actually really good. Um. Spade card. We we do have. First up, convert the left card into the right card. Hilarious. Okay, so aces and the fours. We still, we're doing great. That multi, that double malt is so good. Okay, this has got to be a win, right? Let's see it. Another upgrade for that. The two pair is really carrying me through this. Incredible. Okay, a new Joker has been unlocked. I'm not sure why anti upper achievement is unlocked. Let's go for it. Let's see what we got. This is a voucher. Celestial pack always contain the planet card for your most played poker hand. That's kind of cool. Redeem it. It's only seven, so might as well. And then we got. Converting to clubs. We don't, one, two, three, four, yeah, we don't really want to convert to clubs. All right, so let's just, uh, so the standard packs don't interest me either, next round. I guess I could have bought it and sold it. Why was I thinking that? Cerulean Bell forces one card to always be selected. Okay, this will give me a free Mega Arcana pack, so let's skip that. And then, 
What do we get? Choose two, and we get this. I'm gonna sell this. Uh, converts to diamonds, which would be kind of funny. Doubles the money, increases the rank of two cards by one. Enhances one uh, selected into a gold, into a steel. I could increase the rank of the queens to become kings, but that doesn't make a lot of sense, does it? Converts to how many diamonds? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, so we have multiple diamonds. So we could convert more into diamonds. That would be kind of funny. We could convert these hearts into diamonds. go and then uh there more money we'll go we'll splurge at the end i guess this could be a winning run we'll see discarded spades That's a lot of spades. We could probably discard these. Get, a, get kind of an upgrade that we're going for. And then play... Play that hand. Upgrade the pants some more. A 58 malt is incredible. That a one, but this is such a good score. Yeah, we won. Okay, great. I didn't know we would win that time. I would have discarded more spades, probably. And now we got to spend. We got to spend whatever we can. I'm not too worried about the boss, honestly. Um, Let's open this and probably sell it, honestly. Soul creates a legendary joker? What the heck? The emperor creates up to two. You must have space for this legendary joker though. Do I have to use this now? That's great, let's sell, let's sell him. This is gonna be good. Open this, Celestial Pack Booster. Use it to improve Uranus. And then we're gonna do the Cerulean Bell. Let's do this. Now, we have the threes. We have the, I mean, they're making us play this jack. So this is actually really good. I'm playing the two just to get it out of here. This, this just might be a win. This might just be an automatic win. I mean, this might be my first win, which is great. The Joker pants upgraded with the big malts. Everything looking good with that malt as well. So yeah, this is a win guys. This is a win. We got to play the 10. Let me discard some stuff here. Let's discard. Uh, dang, now we gotta play the eight. Uh, discard, shoot. Uh, nine. Oh, wait, oh man, okay, hold on. Let's just do, Dude, I don't know what we're doing. Let's play this. It's a triple, three of a kind. It's only a level one, but again, we still have the pants. The pants are just great. I think we just won. <laughs> I think we just won, dude. Wow, so the Cerulean Bell we've defeated. What does that mean for us? 
It means we won. We won a run. <laughs> and I unlocked you. You aced it. Thank you. So endless mode. Do I want to continue with endless mode? I mean, I don't think I want to really, but does endless mode continue from here? And if so, okay, so I, I beat the game and now I'm entering endless mode, which is interesting. I don't know how, I mean, I just have a feeling I can keep going and going, which is kind of a little worrisome. Uh, doubles the money. Let's buy it, I'll sell it, I guess. So this is what, this is the endless mode. I don't know that endless mode is gonna be that fun, but I feel like there's gonna be some sort of, uh, there's gonna be some sort of benefit to doing it, maybe. Maybe I'll unlock more stuff if I do endless mode, I don't know. Let's open these really quick. Uh, the hangman destroys up to two cards. Converts them into diamonds, that's pretty funny. This is, the, I, I mean, I won, I won, but now here I am. I guess, what, what do I have least of? Hearts, I have the least amount of hearts. No hearts here, I guess clubs are the other thing I have the least amount of, so I could turn this into spades. So we're basically just rocking with spades and diamonds. So these these uh, all spades are debuffed. That's kind of sucks. I could maybe re-roll that though. Maybe. Uh, let's just play this really quick. So yeah, this is pretty funny. We don't have we have a three of a kind, which is fine. This uh, destroys two tarot cards. I would probably rather just destroy twos if possible. But I've entered in. I, the only reason I've entered endless mode is not because I I really want to play more of this this game. I mean, of this particular game. But I entered it so that you know I could kind of want to destroy that two of clubs. And then Hermit doubles the money. Let's just sell it. To get that upgraded. And then, sure. If you look at our deck, we're low on hearts and spades. Or, I'm sorry, hearts and clubs. This should be another, this should be a win. That is a 64 malt. So I'm anti nine of eight. I just, I just wonder like if, if this run is going so well, how long can I take it? Because this is going really well. This Joker drunkard plus one discard each round. See, I don't really have any room. Um, open this. Destroy two cards. I have to, let's use it on this. Nope, dang. Open this one. Convert to hearts, don't want to do. Tumbles my money again. 
I kind of want to just go in there and, and play, you know what I mean? So let's just go against this guy. If, I, if I'm taking more risk, but if I lose, I'm okay because I already won the game. The spades are de debuffed, which sucks, but uh, enhances two lucky cards. Sell it. Uh, we do have a pair, sort of. Nine, ten, jack. That's fine. Not the greatest start, but, you know, we get the malt from the king. Yeah, good play. Uh, so this one kind of sucks. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's do another straight. Actually, no, let's do a two pair, because that's what we're kind of working with here. And then we'll discard some stuff. I mean, really, I'm just upgrading that. I know it's debuffed. I know whatever. But we still get a time seven multiplier on that. Yeah, the times. The times is what's really at. That's so good. Uh, four, five, six. Oh, we have an eight. Discard those. Another pair, which should upgrade the pants again. We're gonna win, probably, unless we don't. We got one more chance. We're upgrading these pants. See, that's what I mean by taking the risk. You know, like, if we lose, I, I don't care too much because we've already gotten this far. One more play and we win. It's gonna be that. Upgrade on the pants again. No complaints at all. This is actually really good for me. And I've already won, so if you guys want to see me play even more after we've won, then let me know. But this feels good. We'll see what the next boss is like. Uh, what is this? Add one dollar of sell value to every joker and consumable card at the end of round. That's not good. Each play, 10 or four, gives plus 10 chips. This voucher is one card slot available. Sure. Increase that. I can, the overstock redeemed is good. What card slot are we talking about? We're talking about these. Does it apply now? Two chips for every $1 you have, which is a lot, honestly, like a lot of chips. Uh, what would I sell? I would probably sell the castle. Cause that's a much bigger And then I would still, you know, open up these. Converts three into diamonds, which is really good. I'm gonna hold on to that until I get clubs and hearts to do that with. Skip that. Clubs and hearts. Next round. Dude, these are so expensive. So this is what this is. Yeah. So round ten has gotten so. Uh, there's like no way. It seems like there's no way. Let's let's just play it and see if we can win. If not, then whatever. At least we tried. So these clubs are here, and I'm gonna convert them all to diamonds. So one, two, three. Look at that, great stuff, right? So, you know, we wanna see if we can play this. This is ridiculous, though. I have to get half a million, dude. I don't even know if it's possible, but I'm gonna try it. Ah, 
Oh, let's see. Another upgrade for the pants. This could be the end of it, you know. <laughs> this could very well be the end of it, and I'm okay with that. Wow, that's a big, big number. Uh, six, six, four, four, and then the five. I mean, the pants are getting upgraded again, so that's good. <laughs> Is it gonna work? Let's find out. This could be a really good score. We only have one more hand to do this with, so we got to make it count. Wow. Uh, I need 160,000 somehow. I need to squeeze that out of here. I just don't know how to do it. But we already have the queens and the eights, so let's destroy everything. Let's just discard these. Queens and tens would be better. I don't think this is enough though, but let's just see. All right, so we have the queens and the tens, so let's discard even more stuff then. What, would we, what, wait, what would we be looking for? I don't know. Well. I don't know. I don't know if this is enough. I think this is just going to get exponentially harder. Yeah, we didn't quite pull it off, but that's okay. I'm happy with that. We got a really high score. I was hoping we would maybe unlock some more stuff, but that's okay. We got a new voucher unlocked. We reached anti level eight to get this uh, malt of poker hand contains a diamond card, club card, so everything. So basically, like one of one of each. That's all right. Joker unlock, win a run. What did we get? We got this uh, copies abilities of the Joker to the right. That's kind of cool. And we got the abandoned deck. Start run with no face cards in your deck. Ooh, that's interesting because there there could be a card that gives you know that that keeps building for not playing face cards. So we'll try the abandoned deck next round, next episode. If if you want me to play more, let me know. Spectral cards may appear in any of the arcane packs. That's kind of cool. A new Joker unlocked. Malt on final hand of the round. Just kind of a Hail Mary. And there you go. That's Bellatro. Again, I finally won. If you want me to continue this series, let me know in the comments. If not, then, you know, maybe we could just move on to another game. But I had a lot of fun playing this game. I'll see you next time for more. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.